Hi guys, in today's tutorial I want to show you how you can make a timer for your server so people can see on the tab list how long people have played on the server. If you have ever been on one of my servers you may know this because there's always a yellow number in the tab list behind the name. So let me show you how you can build this. First up we need to add two scoreboards and the first one is uh, the objective um, time we want to add and this is a statistic play one minute and if I set this to the sidebar which you obviously have uh, don't have to do um, set display sidebar time uh, you can see that there's now for each player a scoreboard counting up and this is counting up in the speed of the ticks of the server so 20 ticks is one second so if we reach 1200 we reached one minute on the server Next step is to add the minute objective, therefore we do scoreboard objectives add minutes and this is a dummy and we want to set this, I can do it like this, to the uh, tab list, so set display list minutes and you can see that there's now a zero for me because we didn't set anything up. Then you need any timer and I like to use a hopper timer for this and uh, this will give an output into two command blocks. These are the only ones you will need and we need to find out which get activated first by the clock. So we do say A and say B. You may know this from my last uh, command block tutorial. And if I take this out again, you can see that in the chat it says A first. So this one is the one that gets activated first. And we can do um, a scoreboard players at for all players that has uh, a score time minimum of 1200 uh, minutes one because we want to add one to the minute scoreboard when we have uh, a time value of 1200 and in the same step we want to do scoreboard players remove at all uh, with a score time whoops score time minimum equals 1200 time 1200 so we remove 1200 from the player that has a score time of 1200 and if I activate this and now activate the clock you'll see that I got one minute and the score got removed. The good thing about this is, even if I'm playing in the Netherlands, for some reason this isn't uh, loaded, uh, my time will still count up and I can demonstrate this by doing uh, scoreboard player set as petty uh, time to, yeah, let's say I was uh, a few minutes in the nether with 4000 this will um, yeah, count down and at the same time count the minutes up and uh, now it's again that uh, everything is balanced and I even got the minutes that I played in the nether without this being loaded to my scoreboard. So that's um, already it for this tutorial. I hope that you enjoyed it and you can use that on your server. If you uh, enjoyed the video, feel free to leave a like, subscribe if you haven't already and share this video with your friends and I will see you in the next video.